welcome to today's vlog. So it's Tuesday. We are just about to shoot some pictures. It's 12 o'clock and we've done all our emails. We've been talking to the builders because I think you probably all know we have the builders at home and they're sending me videos of like all the things I need to pick. So it's been so, not, not, not like majorly stressful, but once you put something on the wall, it's the commitment. So I think I've made all the final decisions. We need to get some more tiles. So we're gonna shoot this outfit post. Um, I'll show you later. I'm gonna do some pictures for the blog and then we're gonna go to um, Fulham Tops Tiles to pick some extra tiles and then buy some more because we've run out. So I'm gonna take you with me to show you. We've been to Tops Tiles about 55 times to try and choose which ones we want. So I'll show you what we've been doing, how we picked our tiles, because they have everything laid out. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do today and um, I thought why not vlog it. So let's take these photos and then we'll go to Tops Tiles. So we've just pulled over to take some photos. Um, it's so sunny today, it feels like the summer, so I've got a skirt on and legs out. We just met the nicest girl called Charlie. We were just like walking along the street in our own world. And she says, excuse me, excuse me. And I thought she was gonna say like, oh, you've dropped something. And she was so nice, I get so shy. I should have, I should have showed you her on the vlog, but I get shy. So yeah, let's do the photos. I'll show you my outfit. And hopefully this is a fun vlog. Let me tell you this, let me tell you right now Your expensive kiss still burning Didn't know I missed this passion in life Now I'm addicted So now let me tell you why What is up with your smile? It's impossible Not now So, ooh, just finished shooting I um, ended up doing what I normally do And making like two outfits out of one It's very windy We're now on our way to Fulham I'm going to be getting changed in the back of the car I always do that um, this car that I have doesn't have blacked out windows and my old car used to so it's a, uh, I always forget that everyone can actually see me we're going to hopefully try and get something to eat I always feel like Paris is my chauffeur hello? I am your chauffeur no, no, no. Um, so yeah we're going to go to Top Styles I get so excited about doing home stuff like this like this is going to be the highlight of my day um, I wish I could do stuff like this every day. I just love picking out tiles and like my imagination runs wild. But I have to stick to the theme and not go off and um, not mess up the numbers like I did last time because I didn't order enough tiles. So um, yeah, I'm excited, I'm really need there. I need to quickly get changed though. Bonjour, salut. What's going on here? Not good when you get changed in the car. I've got this new thing as well where I'm carrying this around with me because it has my camera, my laptop. It's so useful. I'm using it way more than what I thought. And then I've been wearing this as well, but it looks so good layered. Those photo uh, outfit that I just did, my hair looks so bad today, so I've put this on. If you want to follow someone that has amazing hats, Daniel Pisa, I text her saying I'm going to get you a beige hat that you've got and maybe I'll be more like you. She's one of my favourite people. Um, what was I saying? Bad hair. Yep, yeah, those outfits that I just shot, I didn't have enough battery to do like an outfit pan. So I'm gonna leave all the photos, but most importantly, I'll leave the link below to the blog post with all those outfits, because it's a good one. Um, we're gonna try and quickly get something to eat before we, we go to Top Styles. And I've like turned into like an everyday scruffy outfit again. I'll show you later. Just jeans with a jumper, really. By the way, this Balenciaga hoodie is back in stock. Buy small. I'm walking back this way because he's still not, not ready. Um, buy small because they come up huge. And if you do want one, hurry up because they sold out really quickly last time. I think we're going to go in this Italian. So quick update. We quickly uh, boshed a Wagamama. I've never eaten a Wagamama so fast. And now, you know where we are? I think so. This is where I drove my bike, uh, rode my bike home. So if anyone that follows me on Instagram and you've been following me for a while, I bought a Pashti bike off of eBay and it was in Fulham or Clapham, around this way. And I, um, Paris wouldn't ride it back for me and it wouldn't fit in the car, so I had to do it and nearly killed myself. And he was following me on Instagram and it was funny. Um, I haven't used that bike, by the way. So we are on time for Topps Tiles. So an update why we're going to the Fulham Tops Tiles. We we have a Tops Tiles in Chelsea and it was like a boutique-y, really nice one. And I'd walk past it every day and they used to have the most amazing, huge marble slates. 
and for about a year I've been walking past like I think they used to think I was so annoying so I used to go in there and sit in there for ages looking at all the different tiles and then it when I knew I was going to do my bathroom it took me really bored yes it took me i would honestly say about three months of <laughs> looking at tiles and i was saying to you wasn't i which white white marble do you prefer yes and it was all the same but it's a big decision so hopefully the ones that i've chosen will give you some inspiration and the hardest thing about picking tiles is that it looks completely different in a small sample and then all together on the wall so hopefully me showing you yeah, the be beret today. Yeah, I know. Commercial head. So hopefully me showing you my result of my bathroom, hopefully that helps you. So the yeah. Smurfs. I don't mind being a Smurf. Yeah, that's um, what I was thinking of. So anyway, uh, that's gone. They haven't got that boutique anymore, so the nearest one to us is Fulham. But luckily it's like a really nice boutique -y one, so it's exactly the same as the one I used to go to. So we're here. Let's go. It's me again. I'm going to talk to you some more. He's been sitting there the whole time whilst he should have been doing the uh, pay and display because our permit doesn't work in Fulham. I did the last one and it, we hate doing it because it takes like 10 minutes to go through the app and then the app doesn't work and then you have to call. So I said, I'm not doing the next one. And also I paid like three hours by mistake at the other one. And we were only there 10 minutes. Okay, so. There's a pink chair in the charity shop. See the pink chair. This is really nice. If this was like a parquet or chevron, that would be really nice. What do you think? I have a chevron marble as well. Not that thick. I'm meant to be in here for bathrooms, but I'm getting distracted because our wooden floor is really gets really dirty. Whereas these are tiles, but look like wood. You're meant to be helping. Counting pick me, pick some tiles. Oh, you said marble. Right, so marble. this is the one that we've picked, um, and I really advise that you come and look at it because on the website, um, I mean, I'm not saying it looks bad on the website, but it looks nowhere near as impressive as real life. This to me is like, it's called Arabascato, Arabascato, but I call it um, Calcutta, and then this. Oh my god, this is like Chanel marble. But imagine <gasps> have a wine cellar and have the walls covered. Oh, it looks like you're in a cave. That's not my vibe at all. No, that's my cave and wine I vibe. didn't see this one. Now I feel like I wish I got this one. How amazing the is Chanel that? Marble. It's Chanel marble. Oh, now I'm freaking out because I, I didn't see that before. Should we freak out together? Yeah, let's freak out together. No, you freak out. You even freak the guy out. I'm still freaking out about the Chanel marble. Could I add this? I mean, it would be better if you didn't have that, but... My other fave that I nearly got, I'll show you a sample at home, is this grey and pink marble. I'm definitely going to find a space for that at home. I don't want to get it out, but I'll show you at home. What have you found? Grey grout. Are we now going for grey grout to match the marble? So white feature wall or another marble. So would you do grey grout with this one or do you uh, think white? I think white. I think with marble you want to make it look as seamless, seamless. as possible. Yeah, yeah And just go special. small grout joints, you know, they, they've got really straight cut edges. You can go like one or two now okay. to look like one big panel really. 
And what do you think looks better? This no, it works so good though, that's my favourite when I match up with the Misty Fjord. But there are oh, darker yeah. ones. Um, do you do it in porcelain? Uh, the so closest, the one that I already have, the porcelain. The closest we do in porcelain, so I've got two tiles. This one over here, which is 60 by 60, is the same size as the Please just ask a member of our oh, team. Wow. Member. Yeah, just I didn't see that. Oh, it's been out about a year, maybe a little bit over. Oh, I didn't see that online. And then this is the bigger version. 90 by 90. And will this one come out in a matte version? It doesn't come out in matte. The one, we've got one in matte actually, it's a 60 by 60. I think I prefer the other one. Yeah. So guys, this is amazing. No, actually it's not, because they don't have any of the tiles that we want. And the Tyler wants them by tomorrow, and we can only get them by Saturday only in Sitting Bourne. Sitting Bourne, little coastal resort, apparently we can get it there. So we're done from top tiles, tops tiles, it's completely dark now. So we were there for about an hour, then we went to the Starbucks next door for like another hour. And because I'm having a feature wall done, I couldn't decide which feature wall I wanted. So it took me a long time to work it out. But it's so good that they have everything there and then you can, like they can get out extra ones for you and lay them together. So that's what we did because it's really important that you put things together. And the guy in there that helped us, I was going to pick two types of natural stones. But then when you put them together, he, he explained to me how the veining's different and against the light it can look like a beige tone and a white tone and I'm so glad he told me that. So then I had to start and find something else. But I'm really happy with what I've chosen. We ordered the tiles um, and now we've just got the feature wall to do. I'm just so excited to see it, I can't wait. And then we're going to do our other bathroom which I was going to say is my favourite, but no, they're both amazing. So I'll keep you updated with that. I think it will be done in about two weeks. This has been like a never-ending project for me because we started doing this in the summer. But you just have to take your time because once those tiles are on the wall, that's it. And because we're going for like a natural stone that's quite a premium tile, I have to be certain. So yeah, I'm really happy with them. I can't wait to show you what it looks like. I'm going to show you all before and after and everything like that. And when we go and pick up the tiles, maybe I'll show you in another vlog or something. So now, what are we doing now? Now we're going to dinner with my parents. No, not yet. It's only half five. But yeah, but I was just so excited about it. It feels like it's now. So we're going to dinner with his mum and dad. No, we've got like three hours. Okay, so what do you want to do? Edit photos. Edit photos? Okay. Yeah? yeah? Well, we don't need a coffee, we've done that. Oh, it's green. Um, oh, I just can't stop thinking about my times. So I just got ready to go out. All I did was literally take my jumper off, which is back in stock, I think I told you. And I have this amazing shirt, which is from New Look, such a good find. My favorite Revolve jeans, ignore the towel, I've been in such a rush here. And um, this flat is still being refurbished, so it's a bit all over the place. Um, so we're going to have dinner with Paris's parents at a new restaurant in Chelsea. Um, so we better go because we cannot be late. How nice is this shirt? I really hope that they're still in stock. If it is, I'll link it below. If it's not, I did talk about it lots of times when it came in stock and it just means that you're not following me on Instagram stories. So uh, let's go for dinner. So this is where we're going. It's a new... Uh, restaurant, sorry I couldn't think of the word. It's called World's End Market. Come on in. Every time. Oh, 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 so we're early. I've got my diary because we're going to do some planning, but he doesn't know that. Any cocktails? Do you have any? Uh... Oh, we have so many cocktails, a few based cocktails. Oh, okay, which one? So basically, this aviation. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So we're back. <laughs> I'm so full. I'm all carved out. That restaurant was a meat restaurant, and I don't really eat that much meat, especially late at night. So I had so much carb. That's my side. 
I'm using your charger. <laughs> Paris has got this. I mean, I'm already in my unicorn pajamas, looking very attractive. But he's got this new thing where as soon as he walks through the door, he just strips his clothes off. Why do you do that? Because that feels fat. <laughs> So. You, you showed me pictures of me two months ago. Was yeah, it? I was just I just looked for some pictures and it was November, October. It was my birthday, September. Oh, okay, <laughs> four months ago, and I look a quarter of the size. Yeah, he does, and I, but I that saw does it mean out. the quickest you gain weight, the quicker you lose it. So if I start oh, now, God, I can knows, lose that's it. That's not true. Actually, you gain it a lot quicker than you lose it. So no, sorry, I, don't I have agree to... with that. I can lose it. But you can film Sorry, me in April. Um, in April. So, oh, let me speak. <laughs> well, can you just go on your side? And I, I can <laughs> like, just slot this. Please, side. please let me finish. I'm telling them about my. Um, Where's the lights on? Oh, the lights so bright in here as well. <laughs> anyway, I don't know what I was saying. So yeah, we've come back and. Um, we're going to watch, I don't know, probably some reality TV before we go to bed and have a really early start in the morning. I have a car picking me up at 8 and I have a few things to do before I go. Um, it's a really fun day tomorrow. I'm going to the Crimpia for breakfast and getting my hair done. It's going to be really fun, so I'm going to vlog it. What else was I going to say before you interrupt me? What was I talking about? Uh, shoes and bags. No, I was not. You know, there's more to me than that. So I um, I have my new products that I've been using for four days now. I'm going to wait until I use it for like a good week until I recommend it because I like to really see the results. I uh, first uh, discovered Murad about two years ago because I have some skin blemishes here. And they have the best product to to help this. I can't recommend that enough so I'll leave it in the description box below. Um, it's at my... Bambi, what are you doing? Um, so this is a new one, it's their new one that I'm trying. I have the Renewal U4 Eye Serum. I have to always have an eye serum. The moisturiser. I have the moisturiser. And this is the serum. And I just love Murad. They're kind of like a no frills. I love Murad. I love it that they're like a no frills brand. Like they don't need the extra frills. It's just a really good product. Oh, she's gone now. So let me know if you want me to tell you about this because you can see from my skin, ignore this, I always suffer with really bad, oh, it's a bad angle, suffer with really bad blemishes here but they're actually not that bad considering I've got no makeup on um, but the rest of my skin is really smooth. There's something about Murad products that really help my blemishes and I get that really, really bad. So, so far I'm really happy with it. Um, maybe I'll try and get you a discount code or something like that. If I can get one, I'll leave it on the screen here in the description mm -hmm. box. I'm not sure if I can, but I will definitely try. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna need to get up early in the morning and someone wants his side. He's like sitting on the edge of the bed. So, um, oh, um, oh, they're all in the bed now. So I will, I'll, I'll see you in the morning. Morning. I've got no lipstick on because I'm drinking my juice. Just waiting for my car. This uh, beret is the best thing ever when you've got bad hair. Oh, he's here. Um, I'm going to a hair event, so... Oh, he's just gone past me. I'm going to a hair event, so I definitely need to cover up my bad hair. I'm so impressed with this Murad. My skin is so smooth. Paris kept saying to me, why are you stroking your face? But it's so smooth. I've never had a product that makes my skin that smooth. So yeah, I'm really loving it. It's only been four days. Four days and one morning. Um, okay, my car's here. Let's just come back now. So I'm arrived at the Crimpia. I now have lipstick on. I was emailing, so I didn't actually drink anything. Uh, Paris is going to join me later because I'm just doing a presentation. Oh, he's dropped me at the other end. Oh, I'm really excited for my Crimpia breakfast. So, um, I can't really show you my outfit, but I'll get Paris to do it later, although I always forget. Let me do it now quickly. So I have my... That was crap. That was crap. I'll show you later. Okay, I'm here now.
Good morning, so we're back in Essex. Um, it's 8 a.m. and look what just arrived. I'm going to show you it upstairs. Um, we have all like, uh, this floor's horrible and the builders are here, so this is not me being a skanky, a skanky girl. This is the builders. So this is all like plastic. And here it is. I feel like I should have started filming when I was a bit more awake. Um, but I have, this is going to go in my office only because the builders are in the bar. I'm going to show you it now. But for now, I'm going to put it in. In here, this is a mess. Um, so it's going to go across here because it's only temporary while the bar's being done. But I just think it'll be really nice to have some seat in here and maybe something a bit longer and I'm going to put this in the bedroom upstairs I think I'm going to see how it looks and if I like it I'll replace it with another sofa it's not like I don't have any spares in the garage um, but this is just bothering me here and I'm thinking about getting a new floor and when I did this I always knew that after a couple of years I was going to get bored of this and I really love it, like it looks really nice but I think I've had enough of it now um, so that's that I'm going to go and make the builders a coffee Bambi, are you stressed? I'm going to show you why she's stressed. The Come on, Bambi. Come on. Here he is. Bambi doesn't like him. And look at his little jumper. It says DBM Services, which is the, what the uh, builders are called. Winston! Isn't he the cutest dog ever? He's got this waddle. And he's just so dopey and he was saying, Dan was saying that he just gets bullied all the time in the park. So he has to have this harness bolt on under his jumper so that when he gets attacked they just lift him up. Look at him. I was begging him, I said please bring your bulldog with you to work. Winston! 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 Good boy Winston! Good boy! Are the girls picking on you? <laughs> He's best friends with the Tyler. Look at him. He's being really good. Oh, I know you're just the cutest. I know. Are you smiling? Oh my God. Best day ever. You can see the girls, the girls that are picking on you. <laughs> Ignore my floor, it's because the builders are in there now. So yeah, my, my builders are huge and I give them these cups. I give them like the pinkiest, girliest cups that I can find. And I know I forgot to, um, link my coffee machine so I'll do it this time because it really is amazing one likes tea, one likes coffee um, so what should I do I might show you a bit of the bar it's literally chaos today I've just got to catch up on all my admin and all my work um, we work Saturday and Sunday so I was thinking about having a day off today it's Thursday I don't think I can I keep stealing Winston I gave him a dental stick. <laughs> Please ignore my floor, it's coming up and the builders are all in here. I'm so worried that you think I have dirty floor. He keeps showing you his stick. Winston! Don't slobber on my new sofa. Yeah, okay Bambi. Leave him alone Bambi. Bambi enough. So I think we have some, we have a Bambi, yep. Yeah. We have some samples under here and I can't actually, oh, get them out because my back really hurts. Um, oh, it's so heavy. So this is amazing. Oh, it's really heavy. 
This is um, like fake wood effect, but a tile, which is so amazing because it's gonna be really durable. You're not gonna get any of like heel dents in here. Um, God, I've, these are so dusty. They've been down here like a year. That's the builder. So this is, I absolutely love this sample. This is gray marble and pink marble. And gray and pink marble is literally like, oh, I'm just trying to find the right room where to put it. This is another wood effect tile. And you could use this for like chevron or parquet. And I really, really love that. I wish it wasn't as cream. And it's hard to imagine how that would look full scale, but um, a really good idea. And then there's another Carrera under there, but I'm definitely gonna find a room to do this because it's just so beautiful. I've had them under there for like a year now. It was just such a hard decision to decide what marble to have, but I'm glad I took my time. I'm just gonna leave that there. So this is the huge box that I got delivered. This is me in my outfit where I can't dress properly. <laughs> um, and I also got this package, which I'm going to open with you here now. You don't want to know what Paris is doing behind the camera. You can probably hear it. He puts dog food on the floor. I can't even, I can't even talk about it. Right, I have no idea what this is. I really like it. See pink blue. Oh my god. Have you seen this? I've never been said anything like this in. Oh my okay. god, that is amazing. Oh my god. The Queen. How amazing is that? Can't even see me. That is just, oh my god, and they're pink. I was just talking about pink marble. Oh, there's actually a gift attached, I didn't even see that. Charlotte Tilbury is just, I don't know who they've got on their PR team, but they come up with the best ideas. I'm gonna try and go outside now. I wish these were delivered to me at London and then I could have done a picture outside. Oh my God. Can we take a picture of me with these outside? No, I'm busy. And I'm gonna to have to get dressed. Oh my God, that is just amazing. Okay, let's see what's inside. I think it's lipsticks because I've seen, yeah, it is lipsticks. I have so many Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks that I love. Okay, so first thing is, I'm really sorry about my outfit. I'll make more effort later. So this is Walk of Shame. Love that name. It's like a deep, I haven't got enough hands. There you go. Like a deep red. I love the textures of their lip liners. Um, so we've got three lipsticks. Really is the best packaging, isn't it, Charlotte Tilbury? Okay, so we have the Duchess. Oh, I love that name. Oh, yes, 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 yes. yes. Wow, absolutely love that colour. The lipsticks case seems a bit more pinky, which is really nice. This is called The Queen. Wow, I love these names. It's like a nice summer pink. That looks like it's gonna go on really well. And the last one is like a deep red um, legendary queen. These names are amazing. That's gonna go so nice with the lip liner. I don't know if it's the light in here, but the cases look really pinky. They look really nice. That's my builder. Oh, and I can't move my back. But thank you, Charlotte Tilbury. I love it. I love the balloons. Let me show you another look. Look at that. Oh, I really hope I can take a picture with these before they go down. The Queen Hot Gossip. Oh, I'm just so overwhelmed with this. It's just so lovely. What a lovely surprise. Love this one. So I ordered a few bits from Next recently. Oh God, my back. Um, and I wish I'd got this for Christmas, but this is basically, I mean, I wish I got it myself for Christmas. This is a marble tablecloth and it's a big, huge one to go on this table um, because it's just not worth the stress when we have dinner parties and that everything gets everywhere. So, um, and if you've got like a brown table or something that you want revamping, that's such a good, 
little accessory, £25. Okay, so these have been these have been tried to be delivered to my house like three times because I always forget with Ruiz Via Roma the shipping is really fast. Even though it's coming from Florence, it actually comes really quick. Nicely wrapped like this. I always keep these boxes in the house. Normally if you ever buy something from me from like Depop or something, I normally send things in bags and boxes like this. Oh look at this box. Alexander McQueen, not a brand that I shop with lots. And here they are. Well, they're massive in real life. Oh my God, they look huge. I love it that um, I never pay that much attention and when I'm doing anything in life, really, because I rush everything. And I thought that that at the back, I thought that that was pink leather and I actually really love it that it's suede and it's a lot more muted, like a muted pink. So they come in navy, black or white and I've just ordered myself a new pink bag which will be here in two days probably because it's Louis Vuitton Roma and um, it's going to go really nice together but I just thought it was a nice summer trainer and most of all a bit of height because I don't normally wear heels when I'm walking around so it's something that was nice for a bit of height. I've actually, I said that I was getting these and I've had so many people ask me how they are to wear. So I'll let you know, I'm going to wear them today and for the rest of the week actually. I might put these on and do a picture with my balloons. So that's them. I think they run pretty true to size but keep an eye on my Instagram and I'll uh, tell you all about them there. But it's the Alexander McQueen sneakers in muted baby pink and white. I know you're in there. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that went horribly wrong, didn't it? Yes. <laughs> Surprise! I haven't stuck on yet. I'm not stripping you away. I'm gonna ship you somewhere else.